today I'm going to into bread baking and um, you know what I miss as a German German bread I can't stand this white bread here anymore and this is literally the worst um, so today I got into the mission to buy some proper 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 rye flour and um, you know what that you can't really digest rye bread so um, we Germans love our rye sourdough bread and to get a proper sourdough it takes a bit of a time and um, I'm gonna make now every day a little bit of a video I'm gonna show you how to make a proper sourdough um, all you need is actually just three components um, rye flour a glass jar and water and time this is all you need when you bake with rye flour I'm seeing here recipes on it to make a rye bread um, where it says rye flour vinegar and dry yeast salt and water please guys don't do this don't do this just rather invest in some time and make a proper rye sourdough bread it's much much nicer to eat and it's also much, 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 much nicer. Um, it just tastes better. Okay? Just invest some time. Because if you have the later, the sourdough, the starter we're going to do today, you're going to have forever if you start baking. So, all we need to do today is just make our own sourdough. Would last technically forever if you <sighs> got to bake like every two to three weeks. So, oh, let's so 50 is only 50 grams. 50 grams. Yeah. That's it. 50 grams of uh, rye flour. And we're going to put this now into the jar. All we gotta do is wait. So and um, so fifty fifty grams of uh, rye flour, and we adding fifty milligrams of water. That's it. Okay. So, so all we have to do today we're gonna just mix mix everything together. basically it we're gonna mix everything together and that's it that's it for today <laughs> so um, we don't we leave the, uh, the lid just like this um, open and putting it at the warm place it wasn't so bad for the first day the next day is also the same so it's going to look like this so the next day is we're going to put again 50 grams of flour 50 mils of water for the next three days four days and uh, technically we can use it then on the fifth day so the only thing you need to invest is a bit of a time not really wood i'm going to put this now um next to my heater and uh, gonna show you then tomorrow how does it look like and please join me on the journey and then on the fifth day we're gonna bake then a bread let's say on the sixth day because uh, sourdough bread as well is also not so easy to bake because 
if you want to bake a proper sourdough rye bread you don't need yeast it just takes time so on the fifth day we got to prepare everything and we can bake it then on the sixth day take time but i'm telling you and i promise you it's gonna be mwah. okay join me please and uh you're gonna be in for a treat i promise you that okay guys see you then tomorrow